Hey everyone, Josh here. Today, I'm gonna to give you a quick rundown on what exactly a PID does. The biggest question that we, we often get about PIDs is why would I want one or what does this do for, for me, for my espresso machine? Um, and the answer is simply, it gives you a little bit extra control and consistency over a regular thermostat. If your shots tend to be too cold, they'll come out a little bit sour and under extracted. Uh, if they tend to be too hot, they come out a little bit bitter and over extracted. And uh, one of the things that a PID really does is helps you uh, sort of set that temperature in your sweet spot for your roast and grind setting. So PID stands for Proportional Integral Derivative. And uh, what it does is it's simply just a controller that runs a couple of math equations that determines uh, the best way to heat up your espresso machine. A traditional thermostat is not all that good at hitting its uh, set target. Uh, if you want to look at it on a graph, say here, um, when it starts at room temperature, it comes up, spikes above uh, set temp, back down below it, back above it, and back down below it again. And it looks like a, like a jagged mess. Uh, what a PID controller seeks to do is preempt this wave function um, by smoothing out the curve and leveling off at ideal temperature. An easy analogy to think of it is like driving a car on the highway. Uh, say you're trying to go 45 miles an hour. Um, if you just put your foot down on the gas and go straight to 45 and let off, you'll go a little bit faster and then slow back down, um, which is really similar to a regular thermostat. But when you're driving on the highway, um, you let your foot off the gas slightly once you get near 45 so that you maintain that, that speed, uh, which is in effect what, what the, the stages of a PID controller seek to do. So there are a couple different kinds of thermostat that your machine may use instead of a PID. Uh, these two here are mechanical thermostats. Um, really, really simple machines and uh, early espresso machines used by metallic which simply connected to a relay that was on or off for the heating element. Um, new, newer models use electronic relays, which are similar, um, whereas a PID uh, connects to an SSR, which is a, a different type of relay. It's called a solid state relay. Um, and it actually varies voltage that goes to your heating element to make your temp fluctuations a little bit more controlled. So if you're interested in installing a PID into your espresso machine, uh, one thing to keep in mind is that uh, you are digging into the, I mean, the effective guts of your machine. You're tapping into the electrical system. Um, you will void your warranty um, for almost anywhere that you bought it from, unless you bought it pre-installed from, from SEG or another company uh, that will support the warranty for you. So that's it for my explanation on how a PID controller works. Let me know in the comments below what else you'd like me to explain or learn and then explain. Thanks, and I'll see you all next time.